Okay, our topic for today is monitor the RAM use and available in Savix through SNM, SNMP. All right, the number one is you go to smpd.conf, type nano, etc, smp, SNMP that one then look here so by default this is the default then I add this total RAM use and the total RAM pre so this is the correct OID all right so control X to save and then next service restart service restart the SMPD or to restart the SMPD okay and the third is use the SMP walk so this is the OID that I put in smpd.conf so there's an integer there's a result here then for this SMP walk again, the second OIDs. So, and that's it. Okay, let's proceed to the dashboard of Savix to make uh, item triggers and the graph. Okay, thank you. So now we are here in Savix monitoring dashboard. So go to host and then make an items. So this is for us. This is uh, our next step. Click items. Create items. Okay. So since I already created an items, so. I go to the item I create so this is a free so this is a total and the name is total RAM free the type is Savix agent key is BM memory size free and host interface and the correct SNP OID okay so since I've already added so same pro same process here in total use that's it host interface the IP address of the server yeah. or the computer that you want to monitor and then next steps create triggers so you can create here so since I already create the triggers go here so this is a trigger total three and then click add and then select then select the total free or the total use of RAM okay so since I already add the, this is the expression then click add or update all right so since I already add the the items so now next uh, we can create the graph since already create the uh, items and the trigger so we can go here to configuration host and then graph then create graph okay again host click graph so, and create graph Okay. So from that, you name the 
total ground use over the total ground graph and then click add and then select the items here okay so since already configured so this is the total ramp tree okay so you want if you want to change the colors or what also in total ground views so i change it to red okay so now make items make triggers and create a graph is done so next let's see it's working so go to monitoring hosts then the server that you monitor right click left click then click graph so now let's see the total Okay, this is the total RAM pre graph that we, that I create, and this is the total RAM use graph. Right, it's working. Thank you.